There's my machine coming down. Yo, this is Anthony from Rock Prince, and welcome back. So, I'm very excited to announce that I did get an embroidery system, a 2002 Rakoma double head embroidery system. So, we're about to open it up, and let's see, let's take a look at this. There it is, guys. The Rokoma 20028 series. Let's take a look here. What I got. So, I got all these hoops here. And we're just gonna, we're gonna place them in an area where we don't lose them. Alright. Yeah. Big hoops. All the hoops. They're not hooping around. Alright. Okay, we got the half the cap brackets. And I don't know what was in here. I guess they just used the plus for some extra padding, more hoops in there. There's a toolbox, so I should be able to, I should have a device in here that's gonna help me unscrew those brackets. Take our little toolbox out, see what they gave us. There's our, there's our needles, USB, and then there's all the tools. So there's the Allen wrenches, some solution, and all the others, all the other thingamajigs that we're gonna use. And here it is guys, my Rakoma 2002 S8 multi-head 20 needles on each side. It's a it's a huge investment that I made. Um, I'm very excited and uh, I can't wait to to start pumping this machine out and start making some serious money. Uh, I've been with. You know, been at this stuff for since 2017, actually 2016. And, um, it, you know, I started off doing heat pressing. Um, and then I went to sublimation. I'm, I'm actually meeting a goal that I started a long time ago when I wrote my, um, my goals. And I can't believe in 2022, I'm actually finally here. So don't give up on your dreams. Um, they can come true if you put your mind to it. Okay guys, so I purchased a 20 needle head, multi head unit. There's one and then two. And if you can see right here, it's got um, some tension knobs up on the top and some tension knobs right here. And then you have all these spindle devices that the thread goes through and then it goes down to these other loops and to the the actual thread needle device which I really don't know how to describe it but I'm trying my best and then it goes down to these little hoops <clears throat> and it goes up and around till it gets to the very bottom and one of the cool things is that you get 
uh, an extra light. See that? It looks cool. And then finally, it goes down into the presser foot right here once it's all threaded correctly and it gets down there, okay? So with that, when I first purchased it and I unboxed it, it came pre-threaded. It doesn't come with, it doesn't come with the, the threads pre-threaded like this. It just comes with the strings, okay? So the strings are pre-threaded through up on top and then they have it nice and um, wrapped up for you. But what you have to do is you get a, a welcome packet and they give you all these, these um, threads. So what you have to do is you have to get your threads and you have to tie them up with the pre-threaded, okay, with the pre-threads, and then you have to pull them all the way down into this contraption here, and then you just set it up, okay? So it's really not that hard. Um, it looks, it looks complicated, it looks intimidating, but once you get it going, I guarantee you it's gonna be like nothing. Okay, so with that, without further ado, let's go ahead and start embroidering something. Let's see what this thing can do. Okay guys, so here is what I purchased, which is the MT2002-8S. It is a two head commercial embroidery machine. The MT028S is the largest embroidery machine technology produced by Racoma. Designed with a larger sewing field, smaller sewing arm, 20 needles and two heads. The MT can embroider large colorful designs on both small and bulky items. It is also equipped with our new advanced 8 inch high definition LCD touchscreen panel. Okay, so I'm about to show you what it's capable of doing. Um, it also comes with some software and it's called Chroma. So we're gonna go ahead and open this up. Uh, and, and this is just some software that it comes with where you can actually do your own digitizing or you can purchase digitized um, material and um, you can download it and you can go ahead and print off of it off of this onto your Racoma machine. So like this sloth that I just got, I actually purchased this from Etsy. Somebody already did the digitizing for me. Um, I was able to download it and put it into this, put it into this file. And then now we can go ahead and start the print. So what I'm looking at today is we're gonna do something that I just downloaded that I wanna do and we're gonna go ahead and, and um, show how we can do this. So I have a polo shirt in my garage and let's get started. So now we're gonna go ahead and file. So let's go back to Etsy. All right, so I downloaded this polo. I wanna put this on my polo shirt. So we're gonna go ahead and download the image because I just purchased it and I'm looking for the digitizing software. So I'm going to take this one, I'm going to copy it, and I'm just going to paste it onto my desktop. And there it is right here. Okay. So now I can go ahead and open up my Chroma. I'm going to go to file. I'm sorry. I'm going to go to the folder. We're going to look for the desktop. And we're gonna do this one and we are gonna open. All right, so there's my image. And it's, I don't really know a whole lot about this, but the stitching looks a little weird to me, but it says it's a satin stitch. So I'm good to go. Now, as far as coloring, the color was green. Well, what we can do is we can click on here, the little box down below to the left. And actually, if you want to choose your color, you can. You can pick your colors here and choose. Okay. And that's the way it's going to look. All right. So with that, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my USB. And I'm just going to download it onto my USB port. And I'm going to transfer it to 
the Recoma um, the iPad screen. So let's go ahead and do that first. Okay, so let's go ahead and we're going to do file, save as, and we just remember it's called 20, 126. We're going to change that to Rocoma DST, and we're going to save it. Boom. All right, so let's go to insert this USB and let's go to go to iPad USB, click OK, and we're going to go to page two. And there it is right there, 126. I'll zoom in so you guys can see it. Let's see, bring that down. Got some bad lighting here. Um, OK, so I'm going to select that. And I'm gonna hit save, throw it into a folder. Now that it's saved, we'll go back to machine. I wanna um, upload this one, click okay. And there it is. So now I'm ready to, the file is in the iPad. I'm ready to get this going. And we're gonna go ahead and stitch it. I don't know why it displays like that in the very beginning. The screen will change here and it'll start to show you how it's actually stitching. Okay, let's, so let's go ahead and set up the We're shirt. I'm gonna use this new brother ad, embroidery and sew your life. Um, it, it's a stabilizer, it's a cutaway, eight by eight. And um, we're gonna go ahead and put that Get that right, set up. So I'm just gonna demonstrate some um, something real quick. So if you were gonna put this garment inside a uh, shirt, um, which I'll show you at the very end what I did for my polo shirt, but um, there was a, I had a lot of thread breaks and I had some problems, so I had to re-edit this whole little segment so I can show you what I actually did. So I'm gonna do that for you here, and you just. Put that in there like that. And that's how I had it set up inside the t-shirt. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and set this up. So you wanna just kind of bend this down like that. And then you're gonna push it in until it snaps. Okay, and then we're gonna do our tracing. And then we're gonna do a trace design outline. And then once that's good to go, we're gonna go ahead and hit start. talking about guys it, it, the screen actually changes and it starts to show you on the screen what it's actually threading Look at how detailed that is. Isn't that crazy? And 
it's almost done. And there it is, guys. All right, let's take it to there the table. Is. Let's just break this open. And you can see, look at that. Check that out. Guy on that horse. And then here's the back. And how cool the back looks too. So, appreciate everybody watching this video. Thanks again. Please subscribe to my channel, help support my channel. There's more videos to come and we'll be back soon. You guys have a blessed day. Peace.